Thank you very much. Uh, so I continued uh, with uh, MRS factorization already presented by Gerard. And, but particularly, I will give some application of, of this MRS factorization. Uh, this application concerns uh, polyzeta, uh, polynomial homogeneous polynomial relation among polyzeta, which I try to to explain in the recent report uh, published in Confrontes uh, Mathematics C. Now I would like to present it in uh, live voice what I written. Yeah. The plan of my talk is followed. So in the first part, uh, one, two, part one and two, I will give uh, some recurrent concern uh, polylogarithm and harmonism. Uh, in which uh, uh, I can derive some property about polyzeta. And to establish a uh, homogeneous uh, polynomial relation among polyzeta, I need the technology of uh, non complete gene series. So I will recall also some important results, analytical results. Uh, result of that. Before to throw out some uh, consequences uh, of uh, on the structure of the data, I will give uh, some computational example about uh, this uh, formula in particular, the, uh, the Prich equation. Uh, the Prich equation uh, give uh, Relation um, among the higher structure of polyzeta. Okay, we have something like the Abel theorems on analysis, but the, at this time I try to establish uh, for non contingent series of polyzeta. After that, I will finish some. On the description of the uh, image and the kernel of the polymorphism zeta. Okay, I will explain more why it is a polymorphism. First, uh, as all, uh, what is polyzeta? What is uh, the polyzeta? is just the special values of the uh, zeta function on several variables. Uh, is defined by this. Uh, uh, but, uh, it's a this nested uh, sum, and uh, this sum is converted in the domain HR. Okay. It's a, uh, some HR, where R here is some positive uh, integer, uh, integer. And when is this conversion? Police eta, uh, uh, this uh, sum can be considered as a limit at infinity of harmonic sum and limit uh, of z go to one of polylogarithm. Mm -hmm. Harmonic sum is considered as, uh, are considered as a uh, uh, Taylor coefficient of the polylogarithm over one minus z. And the polylogarithm is defined by, well defined on the uh, unit disk Okay. And now, sorry. Uh, polyzeta, the angle power of polyzeta is uh, spanned by the values of polylocation of one. Here, the multi indices are intercoms with SR fit than one, and R is all. Positive number and of the values of uh, harmonic sum at infinity. Here again, the uh, multi indices are integers as uh, super minimum. Okay. Uh, in this case, when the multi indices are integer, we can see that uh, this multi indices can be considered as a sequence of sequence of some monolith generated by. Integers, which can be 
got uh, I, uh, it's considered as injection, injection with words over the alphabet Y. Again, it is, can be considered as a on B section with words ending with X1, X1 over the alpha, finite alphabet, X0 and S1. Okay. Now you can, you can see that the zeta is some maps over monoid. It's not just, uh, but it will be uh, maps on the monoid with value in C. And in the case of uh, with the uh, integral multi indices, uh, polynomial algorithm can be encoded by words ending with x1. Uh, because uh, this can be decoded by iterative integral, and the iterative integral in this uh, iterative integral, you can observe the order of the words and the order of the iterative integrals. The iterated integral is of a long path, x0, uh, z0, z, and with respect to the different form, omega 0 and omega 1. So, in this, uh, we can already see the role of x and y. This leads to some consider. Uh, the linear words of uh, x, uh, x and linear words of uh, y. X will take it the order, uh, the order x1 fits on x0 and y1 fits on the x0. Okay, and here the calligraphical uh, x in red in the slide is, is in red and will be denoted x or y. And we will consider, of course, polynomial and formal power series over x with coefficient on some commutative thing containing q. And uh, we will consider also the B algebra concatenation and uh, co-product of the shuffle of the the algebra of uh, alpha y, y, we keep it as a concatenation and the dual law of uh, Stephen. Okay. Uh, Gerard already gave uh, the definition of the Stephen and what the Stephen product of the Stephen. So I don't need to give one more again. Okay. Uh, in the follows, I will consider the rings. Often consider the ring is some differential ring uh, of holomorphic function as a simply connected uh, domain. I keep it uh, the different, uh, differentiation, uh, differential, uh, partial. It can be extended over formal power series of uh, X with coefficient on the holomorphic function by derivation, ter by ter, coefficient by coefficient. Okay. Now, completed the definition of uh, polylogarism, uh, I put uh, polylogarism uh, x0k okay, as iterated uh, with the path one to z associated to the word x0k. Okay. It's just a uh, logarithm power k over factorial k. And by this one, the maps and e bullet now become the morphism of algebra from shuffle algebra to angle morphism of polylogarism. It is a morphism of algebra and it is injective. So okay, this map, uh, this algebra polylogarism admit the polylogarism and exists by little words I algebraic basis. Now, if modify, we modify the polylogarism, 
by taking Bollinger-ism over one minus z. This function is uh, expanded as Taylor expansion, and the coefficient of Taylor expansion is nothing else, harmonics. Okay, and uh, this map again is uh, the morphism of algebra to the uh, Stoffel algebra to the Adama function of polygonalism. Here, the, the morphism is adjective, so this uh, algebra admit the PL and X is uh, by L little words for the algebraic basis for the Adama product. There are some equivalent between uh, modified polylogarism and their Taylor expansion. So the map H bullet from uh, Stephen Agatha to the Agatha of Aponixum is adjective. And now uh, Aponixum annexes by little worse for algebraic basis of the Agatha of Aponix. Okay. consequence is three points. The zeta now is really the polymorphism from the uh, Schiffer Agatha or from the Stoffel Agatha to the Agatha of Aplixum um, to the Agatha of Polyzeta. So the polymorphism zeta, uh, for short, I would say polyzeta, polymorphism zeta. Pierre Cartier has already gave a reason why we adopt the name zeta for polyzeta. Now we have a second reason that it is polymorphism zeta. Okay, this we just to need to have uh, their value at the agatric generator. Agatric generator. Here, the linear works for agatric generator for polyzeta. This function is partially defined, so we can extend it as a character term. Uh, now we precise also for the uh, generator x0 equals 0 as a logarithm 1. For the two next generator for alpha by x and alpha by 0, the value of polyzeta are diversion. But here we take the value 0 because the finite part of the singular expansion of logarithm 1 minus z in this uh, comparison scale is zero. The same for uh, harmonic sum, the asymptotic expansion on this uh, comparison scale gives zero as a constant term. Those again have we have a definition of the Z module generated by polyzeta at VK. We can also introduce the uh, space, uh, Q uh, vector space of polyzeta of longer K or of VK. And we can see that ZK is. Q tensor over Z of AK. And Zagier have uh, conjectured that the dimension of AK satisfies this equation. equation. It needs to, uh, it leads, leads to problem, the problem to know if this map, this row is adjective or Z is a cat algebra. So let us see now to study this uh, two conjecture. I 
now to go to record the Abel Light FM by considering the diagonal series on the concatenation suffering behind a bra. This diagonal series, some of a double view, all over of the view, by the uh, unity, uh, resolution of unity is also is a sum of all worlds uh, S W P W P W is the Poincaré Birkhoff binder worlds of the enveloping part, and S W is X dual basis. These two your uh, basis are multiplicative, so we can factorize via linear worlds, uh, so called. Recurrent by Gerard and FS factorization. In the same way, for the concatenation stuff on Biagatra, the diagonal series dy is sum over double view of all works on y star is a sigma L tensor sum of all uh, works on of all works of x, y star sigma l pi is uh, sigma w tensor pi w. Here again, pi one is uh, Poincaré Birkhoff uh, basis of the, the enveloping algebra and pn here is uh, um, the PL for the uh, basis of the uh, Lie Agatha of primitive element. And we obtain here the modify, the stuffer modify of MFS factorization. Okay. Now use, uh, we use uh, two diagonal series, diagonal series to form at first the Jetting uh, series of uh, polymerism is just uh, the image pass and I let tensor identity of the diagonal series the X and the uh, uh, the non-commutative general series of harmonic sum as the image of uh, H bullet tensor identity dy. And using the factorization of previous presented uh, factorization, we can factorize Y uh, at Z and HN in this way. And with the, we can take the definition Z shuffle as uh, the value of one of L regular. Here, the factorization are conversion because uh, all the coefficient on local coordinates of this series are polyzeta conversion. There are no diversion term is uh, in the local coordinate. The same for the Z software, it is factorized via the conversion in the first. And again, here the local coordinate of uh, this couple series are conversion. And uh, this series L satisfies the non commutative differential series, this uh, differential series, okay, and satisfy also the asymptotic condition at zero. Okay. And uh, with uh, the change of variables, x0 equal a over 2 pi i and uh, x1 equal minus by uh, b over 2 pi i is nothing as uh, the equation cassette uh, three and the series z shuffle is nothing as uh, the trinfen associator phi cassette Now, let us uh, consider the third and last for me, the non-cognitive series uh, Z gamma, 
Where uh, here the coefficient gamma double Q is one if the uh, double view is uh, right work or not. Uh, the, uh, it's just the finite part of the asymptotic expansion of the H double view on this now is in the uh, comparison scale and up to B uh, and up to A and logarithm up to B. Okay. And this uh, again is a contact gamma bullet is a character. So we just need to have the value. We just need to have a look at the agarpack basis here. Yeah? We take uh, the basis uh, sigma A. And so, so gamma, uh, gamma bullet is a character. This series is a group line series and we can be factorized by MRS, uh, stuff one modify MRS factorization, and we do appear on the left of this group line series, the factor exponential of gamma y1, and multiply on the left by zeta stuff the last of all is this series. Okay. The, the, uh, the coefficient of exponential, uh, the coefficient of the exponential by one is zero, but in this series, the coefficient is gamma, uh, the earlier coefficient. Uh, for the need uh, is the follow, I will introduce uh, the mono z is an ordinary uh, general series of pi y1 upper n uh, is the uh, one uh, variable series with coefficient on holomorphic function and it's uh, the Taylor coefficient of each p y1 uh, n uh, y1 n is uh, Sum. So we, I can consider this non-computative, this uh, ordinary general in series code. And using the definition of uh, PY, PY upper line is nothing as a polylogarithm x1 over k over uh, 1 minus z with uh, is, uh, this uh, expression. So we get uh, mono z uh, is uh, this function and using the newton girard identity or equivalently, this star, kin star t y k is exponential of this uh, exponential term of uh, Le genre function. Le genre function comes is exponential sum le genre function. This comes series give uh, taking uh, in this formula the finite part on the left and the right number of the symbol icon, we get. Uh, here, B1, uh, B, uh, Y1 is nothing as the function 1 over gamma 1 plus Y1. Here you see that uh, the coefficient of Y1 is gamma, again, is gamma. But for B prime Y1 in the mono mod of a card, the coefficient of y1 is zero. Okay. We will use this non-contingent series later. Okay. Now, the non-contingent series of iterated integral or iterated integral associated to 
works of the review is nothing as the chain series of the function for OBR0 and OBR1 along the path of Z0 to Z. And this series is good line. This is also differential uh, solution of the non complete differential equation. Now we take the transformation function Z map to one minus Z. This change of variable will map on by pullback on the differential for omega zero and omega one by uh, G star G zero equal minus omega one and G star omega one equal minus omega zero. So the chain series associated uh, along the path G Z zero to G Z is by definition is a notative general series of uh, this integral. Yeah, using the ch change of variables uh, is nothing is uh, the substitution on the chain series uh, along the path Z zero to Z uh, by the uh, morphism sigma x0 equal minus uh, x1 and sigma x1 equal minus x0. And now uh, the chain series of this path uh, is rely uh, linking to the non competition series of uh, polyogarism by this formula. It's the same for along the path uh, G Z zero to G Z, okay, and use uh, asymptotic behavior of uh, L at the, uh, zero. We can deduce that when Z zero go to zero, this chain series is equivalent to sigma L Z exponential X one logarithm at Z zero. And we can deduce when z go zero go to zero, the uh, formula linking uh, uh, non cartesian series of logarithm at one minus z is equal sigma of L z z shuffle. This morphism is evolutive, so we can take, put again and to get uh, this uh, relation. Uh, now use uh, factorization MFS uh, of uh, the non-competition stream of polyogarism. We get uh, the second identity. So we can deduce uh, the behavior, asymptotic behavior as one of NZ is equal exponential minus x1 logarithm 1 minus z phi z. Okay. And taking the Taylor expression, we can also deduce the behavior at affinity, affinity of Hn equivalent to cost n by 1. Another term, we get this Abel theorem. Okay. Space the limit of this polyogarithm uh, series of polyogarithm multiplied by some renormalized factor, the counter term. Uh, this is the counter term of all direction polygarism at one is the same. Uh, the, uh, the limit of um, n go to infinity of harmonic sum, H is a non commutative GT series of harmonic sum multiplied by X contra term, contra term of the okay. Now, now use uh, in the, the, the last uh, quality, uh, we take the finite part and we get uh, the each equation. This equation makes uh, the relation between the Schoffer-Langer path 
and the Stephen Agatha of Polizeta. Okay, use the factorization of MRS, it is equivalent to this formula. Okay, here is a Z gamma, here is a Z Stephen. In the second identity, the regulation term use B prime Y. Y is the first pitch equation, use B Y1. In the B Y1 figure gamma, but not concern. So after that, when we uh, identify the local coordinate of uh, this equation, we obtain a relation among polyzeta. You, you, you remember this formula? Yeah. The, uh, here, gamma figure. Yeah. Okay. Gamma, uh, the coefficient of y1 is gamma. Okay. Oh, well, I, uh, I can remark that uh, in uh, this asymptotic uh, expansion, we can say that uh, zeta shuffle of the reduce is the coefficient of zeta shuffle. It is a finite part of the singular expansion of an i in this scale. The, the same way. Zeta shuffle double view is the coefficient of zeta shuffle, which is the finite part of H omega in this comparison scale. And at the present, I think it is the only case we can justify how to realize divergent police data simultaneously at X1 and Y1 for the shuffle and what shuffle is the only one case we can justify analytically and algebraically. Now let's us back to the differential equation here. That is just the first order differential equation. The Galois differential equation is nothing as the Hofdorf of the group is a the group of exponential C, of where C is some Lie series. So we can clone solution of A by multiplying on the left, uh, on the right of L by some exponential of Lie series. And we also we can clone the phi kz by multiplying you know, on the right by the exponential of C. And we have again the asymptotic expansion of the clone solution at one and their Taylor coefficient at infinity. And the Abel Light theorem is again, it's a same form. Okay. It's exactly the clone theorem uh, Abel Light. Abel theorem. Now, if we introduce the DMA uh, is uh, the group obtained by multiply on the left of exponent C. The C is a sum Lie series on the coefficient A and the coefficient of X0 and H1 on exponent C is equal to zero. Okay, in this case, yeah. Again, we obtain the equivalent on the clone of zeta gamma and the clone of zeta shuffle by this formula. We call the Pritch equation again. And it is equivalent to this clone from uh, identity. Okay. We have already saw that. Uh, the local coordinate of uh, the uh, clone stuffer, uh, Z stuffer, and clone of uh, Z shuffle 
e, e há uma mudança polinomial em conversão política. Vir o coeficiente em A. Quando nós identificamos the local coordinator, we get correlation among polynomial, polynomial correlation with coefficient in A, but these coefficients are, uh, these correlations are free of the constant gamma if gamma is not belong to the ring of our coefficient of course. Let us see how to use this formula. For example, for the Prisch equation, this single uh, equation, okay? If we identify the coefficient, identify the coefficient uh, y1 upper k, w, we get the generalization of the uh, gamma y1 upper k. This is a closed formula to give uh, polynomial on the polyzeta, conversion polyzeta, single zeta values, okay, and uh, gamma. The constant gamma, earlier constant gamma, is quite here. It's not equal to zero. It's the same for the other formula, gamma y1 up, okay, look at you. The formula is more complicated, but we can implement it in Hebrew and to obtain their expression by extracting coefficient by coefficient. Okay, here again. We can see they are polynomial on polyzeta and gamma. But when we use this same formula, this equation, we make the polynomial uh, identify the local coordinate, we get the polynomial relation among polyzeta. Okay. These uh, equations are uh, homogeneous in weight. Uh, since uh, all the coordinates are uh, operate, uh, indexes by little words, and little words are totally operate, uh, and we can recoup them by weight okay, to get this relation. Okay. And I insist again that all polynomial relations among polyzeta are independent of constant gamma. It's the same. It's okay for the cloud to clone each equation. Now, since the uh, zeta is uh, Morphism, when we can group the term on the left hand of the of the equality we get and we do appear here the polynomials QL QL will generating inside the kernel of zeta. This polynomial in red are homogeneous in weight. Each polynomial are indexed by linear words, and we can take the ideal generated by QL for the uh, F, uh, FY for the stuff one and FX for the shuffle. We get here, we can see uh, the inclusion. Now we place the uh, symbol equal by zero, uh, we get uh, here nothing else, uh, the, some reflecting system on the local coordinate. Uh, here we can see that uh, for each L on the uh, little words, uh, zeta of sigma L refined to the polynomial on other zeta, uh, zeta indexes by linear words. Okay. And on the right of uh, this uh, reflecting rule, uh, they are the irreducible polyzeta because uh, all these steps refer to its, uh, their self. Uh, self. Uh, 
they don't cannot be reducible. So they are irreducible. And we form a chain weight by weight, the set of irreducible at infinity, and we put their irreducible by the human for all P of Z irreducible. And the irreducible, you can see in this formula that they form a higher generator system for the higher of polyzeta. Okay, now we take uh, the image, uh, inverse image, because now zeta, we already see that zeta is uh, subjective, so we can take the image of uh, the section, uh, we get uh, the refracting system over sigma n. Uh, okay, here L variable is obtained by the Inverse, inverse uh, image of uh, the section of zeta, uh, we have yet uh, again the chain uh, between and irreducible. Okay. We, okay, the uh, uh, sigma L refers to himself. Is this equivalent to say that uh, the QL uh, is uh, QL in Britain? are several of not. So let's excuse uh, uh, summary summary like that. The identification of local coordinate uh, give us uh, the fa two family. The first family is a uh, irreducible zeta values. Okay. Uh, it's, uh, Obtained by the chain, chain. Okay. and the, uh, the uh, inverse image by the section of the zeta, so that uh, zeta restricted on Q, the extension of Q by L irritable to Z, this map. This restriction is bijective. And it gives also the, uh, the set of polynomial of the polynomials QL, generated the Fx, okay, in which for any L, the QL is homogeneous in weight. The weight is not in S, the weight of the little was L. So we have can see that. There is an equivalent to say that Q is equal to zero, or uh, Z, uh, sigma L refined to sigma L, or by definition, sigma L is irreducible. In the case of QL is not equal to zero, QL, QL is a uh, polynomial, the leaden term is nothing as uh, sigma L. Uh, sigma L is a, an element of uh, a is which not uh, belong to L irreducible, so it is uh, transcendent on the Ayaka generated by L irreducible. So that uh, QL is equal sigma L plus epsilon L. Epsilon L, L is a uh, sum polynomial on Q, L, okay? So we can say that the Ayaka generated by SL for L conversion can be decomposed by Fx plus Q, L, directed. This sum direct, sum, direct sum is a direct sum of vector space, of course. So, we have already seen that Rx is included in the kernel of zeta. And now if we take any polynomial on k zeta, not uh, 
we are cons uh, constant tab, no, with our constant tab. Huh? So Q can be decomposed on Q1 and Q2, you know, because this uh, this decomposition and by reduction by Fx, uh, Q1 belong to Fx. So we can see now the image of the zeta is nothing as a zeta is related, related by irreducible poly zeta. And the kernel of zeta is exactly the ideal fx. By that, we can conclude that z is a cracker. Can we put that z is cracker because z is a gamma of zeta is obtained as a quotient of this character algebra by the character ideal. Okay, so that is character. And now, if we take the uh, any homogeneous polynomial do not belong to Kernel of zeta, homogeneous in weight, each polynomial C n is of different way because uh, we have uh, this inclusion. So C could not uh, satisfy the angular solution with coefficient in Q. Mm -hmm. But for any S in irreducible, S is uh, homogeneous in way. It satisfied the previous uh, scheme, so we can say that uh, zeta s is constant over q. So I, I think I I finish. I must stop this part. My time is up. Okay. Thank you very much for your listening. Thank you, Min, for interesting talk. Yeah. Questions? Comments? Yes, uh, <coughs> I have a, a question. Yeah. Yes, if, if you go uh, through uh, slide 23, Is that? Yes. Uh, then you say that uh, uh, at the middle of point one, you say that uh, the map going from the algebra generated by uh, Linden irreducible to Z mm -hmm. uh, is uh, bijective. Yes. Uh, Can you explain a little yeah. more? No, that's the restriction of zeta because zeta uh, zeta is subjective. Okay. Yes. So the uh, the element L A are obtained as image inverse image of Z irreducible by yes. the image inverse of the section. So the restriction of zeta the the map zeta is the, uh, the polymorphism of zeta is defined. The shoots are given there. Uh, I just uh, between them, there are some irreducible zeta. Is. I just take the, the image, uh, adverse image uh, by the section, and uh, so that uh, this uh, LR is uh, adverse image of zeta. Irreducible to form this bijection. And uh, uh, so you constructed a section. Yeah. Uh, did you construct it formally or is it uh, what, oh, uh, uh, a reasonable uh, intuition? 
uh, the contraction is uh, like that. Huh? Okay? From the uh, relation among polyzeta, okay? Yes. Zeta is uh, the morphism, you, so I can regroup on the left all polyzeta, and after that, I use the fact that zeta is subjective. Yes. I just affect the relation, uh, each relation, and exists by this polynomial QR and okay. Yes. I just forget everything to take uh, the indexation by QR. The section you uh, are uh, describing as a unique. Uh, the section is not, cannot be unique. The section can but. Uh, it's not unique. Yeah. Okay. I just take one. This one is um, uh, it's for my convenience. I take this one. But from every surjection, you can always uh, build the section. Surjection, yeah. I can find the section to just yes. to take by this way. But if it is surjective, it, you, you, you need uh, this section to be unique. Uh, at the moment, I don't need uh, this uh, hypothesis that it is unique. I just uh, take uh, at, uh, at this step, I don't suppose that it's unique. I at can least it, it, it is a... Uh, it is a good track. It is a good proposal to, uh, with many, many things to check together, of course, uh, and with people who would like to, because it is uh, easy to implement, as I see. And uh, if you consider the relations you have by uh, identifying coordinates, yes. uh, did you uh, recover the relations uh, up to uh, order, uh, I, I don't know, up to a certain order. Yes, of course. Re recover uh, the relations that you have with double shuffle. Um, yes, of course. Uh, and formally, to prove, uh, prove that the Chris equation, the relation obtained by identification of Chris equation, imply the double shuffle relation. And uh, at the weight term, we have already verified that the own relation obtained by uh, software satisfy the uh, Zager conjecture, dimension Zager, uh, dimension conjecture. And we can say that if all are correct, we obtain the set of algebraically independent polyzeta. Okay, I am not a specialist of the subject, uh, but uh, the Zaguier paper, uh, in the Zaguier paper, I don't remember which one, uh, which year, but the, the, the direct sum was formal direct sum. Yeah, the, the paper of Zagier, uh, Zagier is this one. In uh, this paper, in uh, Birkhauser. Oh, yes, yes. This uh, paper. Yeah. The, the direct sum of uh, Zagier concerns EK. I show back EK. But it was very descriptive in style. so. As he didn't say that it was formal, I think it was formal at the time because it is still conjectural. Yes, yeah, so I, 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 don't, I don't ask uh, Don uh, yet because in yes, the paper, exactly, exactly, exactly. In, in this paper, he seemed to say that he gave this direction is some, uh, something is uh, abstract and uh, formal direct sum. Why is that? Here is something is uh, closely, closely 
construct of a an uh, arithmetic constant. Okay. Is, I don't know what he means that this sum is direct, but this sum direct, I already saw that, that correct. No, it is direct because it is formal. So you take the slices, AK, and you put them in the direct sum uh, in the in Zagier paper. Because they are quite defined, AK. Maybe Dominique Manchon, I, I speak under the control of Dominique Manchon, who uh, knows the subject much more than me. Uh, yes, so maybe we can, uh, because in two minutes it has to be talked by uh, Natalia. Okay. So maybe we can okay, uh, okay. discuss this later. Yeah. Okay, thank okay, you. So, thank you, thank you again.